What is going on everybody? Welcome back to another LSPDFR video. If you guys haven't seen the video that just dropped an hour ago, go ahead and check that out. There's some announcements in there and there is a new series that we're going to be doing on the channel. It's a pretty rough, um, I had to talk a lot, which I wasn't used to doing because with these videos I can just talk in police voice and it's very easy to do for me. Um, but with that video I actually had to make dialogue. And that's why I just kind of did a lot of announcements and where the channel is going to be going. So it's a good video to watch if you are wanting to. Attention all units. We have a suspect down the if you are wanting to uh, know where the channel is going to be going and uh, the new stuff that we put in. So today we're going to be go ahead and rocking the. Why can't I think of this? The Crown Vic. Um, and we're going to be going on this road, uh, Richmond Glen area. Um, we're going to be rocking this road, uh, runs alongside the stream, so it is an area we haven't patrolled yet, so that's the area we're going to go ahead and set off to. It's early in the morning, about 4.30, so uh, we're definitely going to be doing a day patrol today. Uh, other than that, let's go ahead and get right into the video. Um, 20 David to dispatch, go ahead and mark me, 10-8, mail for calls. 10-4. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and pull this person over. Um, they didn't come to a complete stop at the stop sign. Uh, they kind of did a rolling stop, so. Come on. There you go. What the? Oh, I thought they were about to just drive straight into the wall. All right, 20 David Dispatch, I'm going to be out with a black two-door classic car rock. This is going to be times one. We're going to be out on southbound Rockford Drive. Uh, no additionals needed. 10-4, copy that. Go ahead and run the plate real quick. Valid, valid, not stolen. Um, looks like we got room right here, so. Oh, yeah, I forgot. I installed the vehicle enhancement mod, so there's much more things we can do to the vehicle. Um, I gotta hold it down to close the door all the way. What's going on, sir? Officer Todd with the uh, Highway Patrol. The reason for the stop is back there by the gas station. Uh, you turned right and you blew the stop sign. Um, is there a reason for that? Yeah, well, someone could have been dead. That's the reason why laws are put in place. All right, go ahead and hand me all your license, registration, proof for insurance for me, please. All right, go ahead and just stand tight. Like, go ahead and just sit tight. Stand tight, that's what I said. Go ahead and stand tight. All right, so we're going to go ahead and run the stuff real quick. Um, see what we got going on. They got a citation shooting from a vehicle or roadway. Well, that's interesting. That didn't happen too long ago. Actually, yeah, it did. It happened a couple months ago. All right, well, they're definitely getting another citation just because he made me mad. So, like I said, guys, respect goes a long way. If you're ever pulled over, just respect the officer. They don't want to really give out tickets, but if you're going to be a douchebag, most likely you're going to get one. Just like this case. Just like this guy. All right, I really got to remember to close that door. All right, sir, I went ahead and rate you one citation. Um, respect goes a long way, and you're kind of being a douchebag. So uh, here's one ticket. Go ahead and sign here. It's not a mission of guilt. It just says that you receive the ticket, and you acknowledge that there's a court date on there. Um, you're free to go once I get back in my vehicle. All right, so we're going to go ahead and get back in our vehicle, head back up the road. Um, and, uh, yeah, 20 over dispatch. Go ahead and mark me 10-8. And he almost That's just hit more. someone leaving.
All right, so we've observed this guy multiple times. Um, we've got in West Vinewood. So we've observed this guy multiple times jerking his wheel around. Um, that sounded terrible, but um, so we're gonna go ahead and get him. Oh, he almost just drilled that barrier. Um, pulled over. Um, I he's most likely drunk. So, 20 of dispatch. I'm gonna be out with a black and colored Sand King northbound U.S. Route 11. Um, I can see he's going to be times two. Uh, no additionals needed. Possible DUI. 10-4, copy that. Alright, so we're going to go ahead. Oh, one sec. Nope, I'm going to do this right. There we go. Okay. What's going on, Officer Todd with the Highway Patrol? Reason for the stop is I've observed you multiple times, um, swaying back and forth. Uh, it's pretty unsafe. Um, yeah, you have you anything to have you anything to drink tonight? I got a small order of alcohol coming from the vehicle. Sure about that? Um, where are you coming from? Came from the hospital. All right. Well, then where are you headed to? You're going to your friends, your friends home. All right. Well, go ahead and hand me your license, registration, proof of insurance for me, please. And then does your uh, buddy over there mind handing over identification too? Alright, awesome. Thank you. Go ahead and just sit tight for me. Thank you. Like I say in all my videos, the passenger technically doesn't have to give me any form of ID. Um, they are free to say no, but uh, most of the time they say yes. Also, it seems like uh, everyone's coming from the hospital when I ask that question where you're coming from. But, uh, alright, so it looks like we got Lucas, um, he's been stopped three times, um, and then we got, uh, we got my boy Mark, Mark, Mayor, Mark, Mark Cohen, so, I don't even know. Um, valid nothing, yes, concealed, and handgun. Uh, so... It looks like we're going to go ahead and get our driver out, um, perform a sealed sobriety test on him, and we'll go ahead and i got to remember to do it. Um, never mind. Fuck it. Uh, whatever. Um, and then we're going to go ahead and do a sobriety test on our passenger, see what he is, and we'll let him bring the vehicle home um, if he's good. So uh, go ahead and step out of the vehicle for me, sir. Thank you. All right, so go ahead and follow me back here. All right, so here's my issue. Uh, when we were driving, I observed you all over the road. Um, that's the first sign that uh, you had too much to drink. Uh, second, when I got up there, when you rolled the window down, all, I smelled a large, a uh, large uh, amount of alcohol um, coming from your breath. So uh, this is what we're going to do. Uh, we're going to do a field sobriety test on you. Um, matter of fact, we're just going to do the breathalyzer test on you. Do it right away. Get it over with. See where you're at. Um, and then I'm going to do your buddy as well. And we're going to see if I'm going to have to tow the truck or not. Or if you get to take it home yourself. Thank you. All right. Yeah, that's what I, that's what I thought. All right. Go ahead and turn around for me. Uh, you have the right to remain silent. Anything you say or do can be used against in the court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If you cannot afford one, one will be appointed to you free of cost. Um, you're under arrest uh, for having .155. Uh, legal limit is .08. So uh, you don't have anything that's going to poke me, stick me, or hurt me, correct? All right. There's nothing open in that vehicle, correct? You don't got any open containers in there or anything? Um, go ahead and just sit tight for me. All right, go ahead and step down for me. All right, so here's what we got going on. Um, your buddy here, he was over the legal limit, so uh, he's going to be under arrest for drinking and driving. I'm going to go ahead and do you real quick, make sure you're good to go, and uh, I'll let you take the truck home um, if you're under the limit. Thank you. All right, awesome. Okay, so here's my thing. Um, you came back all zeros, so that's good. Uh, but my issue is is that you should have been the one driving. You should know that. You should understand that. Um, you knew he was drunk. Um, as soon as I got up there, I knew it. So you definitely could have uh, saw it. So uh, just be smarter. It's your life, man. 
Um, you definitely want to cherish it. You only get one of it. So next time, if you're ever put in that situation, make sure you're the one driving, um, especially if you're the one that wasn't drinking. If you are the one that's drinking, make sure you're not driving, though. Um, but other than that, I'm going to get let you go. Uh, take the car wherever you need to take it. Um, but other than that, you're, uh, you're free to go, sir. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and get him a transport out of here. Uh, and then we're going to go ahead and write up, uh, write up an arrest report. Looks like this is our driver. So we're going to go ahead and get him um, DWI, driving while intoxicated. And we'll get those charges submitted in. And we'll wait till... Never mind, she's already here. So we're good to go. 20 David Dispatch, go ahead and mark me 10-8. 10-4. Alright, yeah, go ahead. Just cut me off. What the... I don't even know who to pull over for this. Come on. I'm pulling over this guy. Twenty David Dispatch, I'm going to be out with a two-door box truck, uh, gray in color. I can see is going to be unknown at this time. Heading north, Pounds, and Kudo Road. Uh, four, copy a D-loader. That. That's what we pulled over, a D-loader. All right, we're going to go ahead, and there's no registration to this vehicle. All right. So, uh, we got no registration to this vehicle. They ran a stop sign and cut me off. And, uh, it looks like they also did some wacky crap back there, which I don't even understand what just happened, but, um. So, David, it's like a shot. That was not how that was supposed to go. Um, I could just cut this part out of the video and just pretend like this never happened, but, um, actually I'm going to go ahead and keep this in the video, and it's honestly great footage of how fast, um, a scenario can turn from you. Um, I have a mod installed that is realistic, uh, realistic gun fire gun shots, I don't know how to explain it, but the damage you take from bullets is realistic. Um, so obviously you saw one shot to the chest. Um, I don't have a vest on. Um, did it. So it just really shows how fast um, scenarios can turn on you um, when you're honestly just not paying attention. I wasn't at all. Um, I got out of the vehicle expecting just to walk right on up and I was not expecting him to hop out. So we're going to go ahead and re-get everything set up and head back on out there. But um, I am going to keep this in the video just to show you guys how fast a scenario can turn on you and um, what the dangers are of a pl uh, being a police officer um, and what they have to deal with, obviously. So I'm going to go ahead and get everything set back up um, and head back out there. But, uh, yeah, I'm pretty much back set up here. Um, that one guy is still on the run, but we're not going to go after him because technically we wouldn't be allowed to because we would be dead. So um, other than that, we're going to go ahead and wait for that uh, pursuit um, to be terminated and then uh, we'll go ahead and head back out on patrol. Attention all units, assault with a deadly weapon in uh, Badham Canyon. Tony David Dispatch in route code 3. Alright, so looks like we got a uh, call of someone with a knife um, up on the road making threats. So we're heading up there right now. What the? Why would you turn in when I'm trying to pass you? But, uh, so we're heading up there. We're going to go ahead and see if we can uh, um, make contact with the individual um, so we can de-escalate everything. Sorry to dispatch. Uh, I have a suspect right here. Don't come. Sir, stop. Put the knife down. Put the knife down, sir. 
Sir, put the knife down. Drop the weapon. Put the knife down. Get on your knees. Go. Get down. Lay flat. Hi, David Dispatch. I got one in custody. Attention. This is Dispatch. We are code four. No further units required. All right. So what do we do? Decide to go threaten everybody with a knife today? Let's get you out of the road. Oh, I did not mean to do that. Hold it. Uh, nope. Get back out. Get back out. Get back out. Someone pull the plug out there. Get ass. back out of the car. Thank you. All right. Hell. Now I gotta go fix this over here. Now that we got this all fixed. Alright, sir. Uh, you're not going to think it's going to poke me, stick me, or hurt me, correct? Baggy of heroin. Nice. Alright, we're going to get you a prison transport out of here. Assistance required in Van Ham Canyon. All right, so basically what we're going to do is get them written down for possession of heroin. Um, oh, my. Okay. Assault on a law enforcement officer. Look at this record. Holy smokes. That is, oh, that is just nuts. All right, so I got an assault on a law enforcement officer. Possession of heroin. Um, Attempted uh, assault on an officer. There we go, assault. Assault on a law enforcement officer, and then we got I have a firearm. It's just a well. He did come at me with a knife, so we can also get him for attempted murder of an officer. those charges which just adds to his record this guy needs to be put away anyway and uh, that's gonna be the patrol um, the reason for this patrol not being as long is because uh, when it, I'm like it's like two o'clock in the morning right now and this is the second video I'm filming so uh, I'm gonna go ahead and pull on over here and we'll go through everything When we do a double post like this, you could probably expect the videos not to be as long, but don't worry. Um, tomorrow's video will be just as long, um, or as it should be. So, the recent thing that just happened right there, uh, I got a total of 20 years in prison. Um, we got fined, looks like uh, almost $2,000. Um, got a year for the heroin, 19 for the attempted murder of a police officer. Um, assault on a law enforcement officer, granted probation for that of a deadly weapon um and then we got our dwi um and i believe that's and then failure stop the stop sign but uh anyway i hope you guys really like today's patrol and i hope you guys like the video before um this one that just came out uh it's just something new that i'm doing um there's announcements in there so go ahead and definitely check that video out i'll put it at the end of this video um but other than that, uh, I hope you guys also liked the one um, stop where I was actually end up shot. Um, well, I hope you guys didn't like that. But like that because it definitely just goes to show um, how fast a scenario can flip on you. Um, 
But other than that, go ahead and have a safe rest of your day and peace.